Now in its seventh year, Ben Jackson's live one-man show, Magic Music and Mayhem, has turned into a must-see experience for locals and visitors alike. I like all those things you just mentioned. And if you want to know why he's Houston's favorite magician, Jackson joins us now to show an example of his refined craft, no flashy props needed. Ben, welcome. Dean, Houston Live, <laughs> we're back. Round two. It's been too long, and thank you for bringing us this lovely gift. So kind. This for tradition, <laughs> something sweet for you guys. Ben, we got to talk about your background because this is a big deal. First place winner of the World Magic Seminar in Vegas. Yeah. You performed on NBC's Today Show with David Copperfield. Yes. Wow. A private yeah, wow. show to Nolan Ryan who was just blown away. I mean, this takes not just skill, but magic. Uh, right? I think so. It's a combination of a little everything. When That's did you realize you had this gift? I was visiting some family friends in Kansas, and my dad's good buddy is a magic enthusiast. He showed me some magic after Thanksgiving Day dinner, got me excited. But I didn't part, at least start pursuing it until I was 15 years old, and that's really got me excited. So. You know what I, I love about this is that ma you hear magic. Derek wanted to do magic when he was younger, too. Oh, yeah. There's only a few handful of people that really stick with it. You know, at yeah. 15, like, what did you decide to say, like, I I'm sticking with this? Oh, I think it was just the, the positive feedback I got from family and friends, and then getting the courage to go out and do it. It for, hey, uh, unsuspecting people. Do and you nailed that place? trick every time, right? <laughs> well, you know, hey, I don't always get it right, but uh, that makes the show fun and exciting. So We're seeing some video of you hanging out of the Four Seasons. We love that spot. It's casual. It's cool. You do this show down there. Yeah. And this, Ben, is so cool because, as we see from this video, this is a front row seat. People are yes. seeing your skill up close. Most of the time when people see magic, it's either really far away yeah. or you're on television. You'll get to see that really up close intimate experience, but that's what this show is all about, is inches away from the action, visual sleight of hand, theatrical mind reading, cocktail attire, so it's a really fun dressy date night out. And you can try to see what's up his sleeve, but I guarantee you, you won't be I don't know, maybe. Right. You're pretty close. I mean, you're pretty close. Well, so. here's the show details. Magic, Music, and Mayhem, February 11th, 25th, and 26th. 7 p.m. and 9 p.m. are the two showings. February 12th at 4 p.m., 7 p.m., and 9 p.m. at the Four Seasons Hotel Houston. Tickets start at $55. I know you did not come here without having some magic ready and available for us. Oh, I'm, I'm totally ready. I'm okay. totally stoked, totally pumped. Some sleight of hand coming right up, close and personal. I learned all this stuff on a cassette tape on the way over here. This may not work out, but uh, but Derek, let's give this a shot, my man. Old school wow. slide of hand. I'm gonna run my thumb down the side of the pack, Derek. Whenever you want, you holler, stop. I'll flash you a card. Okay. And that will be yours. Okay. okay. Here we go. Say stop. Okay. Stop. Lock it in your mind. Don't say it out loud. Got okay. it. I'm yep. not gonna peek. Okay. Much? Where's the monitor? <laughs> what is it? It's okay. It's okay. So watch this. Mix, 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 mix. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. A bit of a snap. One card will fly out of the deck right here. Boom! OMG, the queen of hearts. No. I didn't say it was your card. I said it was the no. queen <laughs> of hearts. Are you serious? I don't normally do magic this early. Okay, Derek? Give me some slack. Uh, hold, hold on to the pieces there for me. And just okay. what, tell me, what was, that? what was the card? I'm so, I'm so sorry. It was a two of spades. Yes. I was way off then. I'm sorry. Okay, two of spades. Watch carefully, team. We can always rectify it. Look at the two of spades. You'll see the very ink on that card change <gasps> into the queen of hearts. And if that's now the queen, Derek, no way. OMG, slowly. <laughs> Show it to him, team. No way. What no, is that? Stop, stop. What is that? Oh, is that now the two? The two spades! Oh. Oh. I'm telling you. What? OMG <laughs> is right. I get, oh. I get chills being around me. Seriously. Oh my gosh, Seriously. I, was, I was watching you so close. How did that happen? I don't know. Lauren, take out your hand. Okay, okay. Squeeze okay. the pieces for me. Okay. Squeeze Hold the pieces. You know, what I, you know what I appreciate about Houston Life? What's that? It's a team effort. Okay. Yeah. The camera operator, the segment producer, the hosts, all the pieces coming together to make the magic happen. That's right. All the pieces uh, coming, coming together. together to make the magic happen. No way, Lauren, in your own hand, those pieces. Stop, stop it! Oh. <laughs> Boom, baby, yeah! I'm getting excited. That's crazy. Wow. I have to ask you, though, how many times during your show do people say, come on, how did you do that? Well, Are you sick of hearing that? <laughs> that makes the show fun. And that really, the star of the show is the audience. It's right. the thoughts that they have, the decisions that they make that make every show fun and unique. And I feel I'm kind of a little starstruck with these celebrities here. And I'll tell you, <laughs> where you can also see celebrities is at the Four Seasons Hotel. Because when all the VIP guests come from out of town, that's where they stay. So I want to try one last thing. Okay. okay. I want to think of a celebrity right here, right now, using one of my favorite books. 
Celebrity Fails. Oh, okay. Yes, all right, so <laughs> Lauren will do this. There are 130 pages in this book. I want you to name any page between one and 130. And just before you do, just so we know, we did not set this up. We no. didn't meet before the show. No. This is off the cuff. What page would uh, you like? Let, let's go to 92. 92. 92, yeah. 92. Yeah. Team, come in close with us. I want yeah. you to look at this. Had she said 36, Laura Dern, 42, Bill Clinton, Mike Tyson, Julia Roberts, 65 is Hugh Grant, but you said 92. 92. I'll keep on going down. 86, that's 88 is uh, Ryan Gosling, and 90 is Jason Kidd, but on 92, that is... Tom, Tom Cruise. Cruise. Okay, Tom okay. Cruise. Now, yeah. okay. had you said anything else? Shia LaBeouf, or Christy Alley, Rob Lowe, Mick Jagger. Okay. Tom Cruise. Team, what if I told you that I was so confident that I knew that you would think of Tom Cruise that I actually brought you a Valentine's Day cookie in the shape of of Tom Cruise Stop it. right there. Is that good? Uh, oh, okay. No, no, no. Sorry, I sorry. See it. Now, yes, look at I this. see look the at this. resemblance. The cake. Do you oh see it now? Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Tom Cruise, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> We're not wow. worthy. Oh, wow. my gosh. Oh. Wow. It's good. Ben. It's tasty. Uh, oh, my goodness. <laughs> ben Jackson, that was incredible. Go see the show. This is why locals and visitors, they go see the show and then they tell everyone because it will blow your mind. That was incredible. I'm sitting right here. Like, how does that happen? Awesome job, Ben. Thank you so much You're for so tickets welcome. and more information about magic, music, and mayhem. Head over to our website, HoustonLife.tv, and click on the Scene on Houston Life section. Wow. I'm going to be wow. thinking about this for the rest of the day. <laughs> Tom Cruise cake. Gosh. Wow. Hey, it's only fitting. That's <laughs> right. Ben Jackson, thank you. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> After the break, a look at what's coming up on tomorrow's show when we celebrate the diversity of Houston. And as we had to break, let's check in with Kevin Frazier for a look at what is coming up on Entertainment Tonight.